one simple principle is when you look at the program. I mean, a lot of companies is product centric, and when they the starting point of the planning is all product based on using product as a starting point and using ROI as an endpoint, which is nothing wrong with that. But I think most of the company operates this way. But the the the, the customer centric company is really. Uh, the, the planning start with the customer. What does customer want, and uh, what we can offer to customers, and uh, using that as the main thread of the conversation in the day-to-day -day business. Uh, I mean, I mean, I, I wouldn't say this right or wrong way of doing things because uh, I mean, it's not guaranteed a customer-centric organization will perform better financially. There's no guarantee, but it's just different approach and a different philosophy to approach a business. It's getting easier and easier nowadays with the social media, I and mean, then you can get real-time feedback online if you have a public profile on Facebook or Twitter. So, but that that causes a problem as well. I mean, and uh, and uh, sometimes customers tend to overblow things, but then that is becoming the market reality. If you need to know how to handle that, and uh, but more importantly, you need to have a very structured way to collect customer feedback as well because. I will say what's available on the social media. Sometimes, a lot of times, there will be a lot of negative stuff, but doesn't mean you're doing the business so badly. But you you still need to continue your traditional uh, customer research to regularly gather feedback from the more traditional channels to be kind of more representative as well. Yeah.